Hey everybody, Jonks here from Got Friends, and today's just going to be a quick little tutorial for all the livery creators out there. Um, one thing we've noticed is there's a bunch of awesome liveries out there for Got Friends aircraft, but uh, sometimes the thumbnails um, haven't been either generated correctly or the user doesn't know exactly how to generate a thumbnail, and maybe this is your first time generating a thumbnail and you just kind of want a quick tip. So today I'm going to be showing you how we generate thumbnails on all of our Got Friends aircraft. Super fast, anybody can do it um, for livery makers as well. This is some very important information if you like that standard looking thumbnail. And once again, this is all preference and opinion, right? So if you're creating a special thumbnail or you'd rather do it a different way or you want to highlight your livery a different way once it's on distribution, then that's up to you. But this is just how we do it and this might help some of you guys out there. So the first thing you want to do is uh, turn on developer mode as you can see with this top toolbar. If you don't know how to do that, you're just going to go to Options, General Options, Experimental, um, sorry, Developers, not Experimental, Developers, and then turn this from Off to On, and then Save. Once, once you have that uh, Developer Mode turned on, you can go up here, and you'll now see this thing called Aircraft Capture Tool. You can go ahead and click that to open it, and you'll see this nice display pop up, and it tells you the tool only works in the hangar. So you can go ahead and click this triangle to minimize that for now. Go ahead and go into your hangar. Find your livery. Uh, in this case, we don't have any community livers, right? This is just the release version. So I'll just demonstrate that with our Kermit Weeks livery. So you want to click on the aircraft, and then in the aircraft capture tool, you'll now see that there's stuff here to do because you're in the hangar. We do add preset Reno, and then we just delete the bottom three. So you have two remaining, the 1618 by 582 and the 600 by 216. Then under camera, go ahead and click that, go all the way down to marketplace. And we've made a marketplace camera for all our aircraft. So to get the perfect thumbnail, just scroll down until you see marketplace. Do that for both of them. And then you just hit capture. It's going to ask you where you want to save that. In case my place, I'll just put it in my downloads folder and just call it thumbs create a new folder called thumbs my bad and then select folder and it will capture the aircraft we'll do a little screen jitter there and then now if you go ahead and look into your thumbs you'll see the Reno folder which has our beautifully generated thumbnail which you can then drag into your livery folder um, for your distribution of your paint kit or your uh, paint that you've done for our aircraft So hopefully this little tutorial helps you guys. It's a uh, real quick But it just helps you figure out that got friends has thought about thumbnails for the marketplace um, And specifically for each and every aircraft we have out there We have one of these cameras set up so that you can get that perfect uniform picture uh, that fits in not only with the already set liveries that we have here so it will just look like the rest of these at the very end um but yeah ho hope you guys have a good time looking forward to the f4f release tomorrow and uh gonna see you guys out there flying see you later